All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duel. So today is Friday. That means that we are playing with Ancient Gears. We're actually trying a different one. We're not trying a fusion base. More of the rank four base, the level four uh, base one, the, the silver gadget, the gold gadget, the Kyoto Curry. So hopefully that goes well. Wow, I drew both my freaking uh, reactor dragons. That's that's awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. The, the card, I ran two of these because I could pop and then get some in both from my deck. And then I draw both of them. So that's 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 great. That's That's awesome. So, uh, I could go into like, Gear Giant, like the best, that's like one of the best plays I could think of, is actually going into freaking Gear Giant. Like wow, this is actually, this is actually kind of sad. This is, this is, this is a terrible fucking hand. Terrible fucking hand. Now we'll go into Gear Giant, who can at least search for my ancient wyvern, so I can at least get the search of my, uh, card, maybe I can grab, if I get my filled spell. Uh, if I get one of these, actually, I can do a pretty strong play, because I can summon Summon, go into Kara Curry play. I don't know. I don't know. They're both fairly decent plays. Now I think I'm gonna get the Wyvern because the Wyvern gives me a plus. Like, ugh. Like, why? Why did I have to draw both of them? Both of them. Like, not, not one of them. Both of them. So they're pretty much dead in my hand. Like, and when I special summon them through the through the means in this deck, uh, I won't get a plus. Like, you know, summoning from my deck to my field. Like, no. no I'm just summoning from my hand. Awesome. Like, ugh, ugh. Terrible, terrible. Oh, and it's fucking Metal Foes too? Of course. Of course. Everybody in the mother's gotta play this fucking deck. Like, I am bet I'm gonna see the shit at the Utah Regionals that I'm going to. Uh, fourth time trying, I said Utah Regionals is my fourth time going. I go to Utah Regionals more than I go to freaking Vegas Regionals. So, uh, hopefully this time, oh my god, if he's playing the fucking Box of Friends. Yep, Box of Friends, pop and then get to summon two normal mods from your deck. Like, yep. Uh, that's not. That's this. I said, Metaphors is literally turning into a conglomerate cluster fuck of anything that is decent. Anything that has a really strong play, they can do it. They'll play the fucking Cleese so they can make Infinity. They have the fucking Gofu so they can make Ultimate Tazokin. They can make fucking. Like, there's so many fucking things that this deck can do. So many things. Like, this deck is gonna get fucking. Like, oh, I can't wait to go ahead and see it. I already know. I'm gonna be seeing this shit. So. He hasn't even Pendulum summoned yet, so. He can, he can fucking pendulum summon, he's plussing, he's, he's just, he's just kicked the shit out of me. Don't gotta open up with straight up trash. It'd be a great time to have X-Ton. I could just summon this, summon this, get a search, go into X-Ton, blow up all his shit, but nope, X-Ton is banned, so rip on that, if I survive, if. <laughs> so summon, 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 yep, summon eccentric. I'm, I might be dead. You can go ahead and tribute to the eccentric, pop my shit, like, look at this shit. I'm nothing. I'm nothing compared to fucking this shit right here. This shit right here, nigga. This shit right here. This shit right here, nigga. Like, this shit is top tier shit, boy. But, uh, yeah, this is my fourth time going. And I just, I don't want to get, I don't need to get top eight. I don't need to, I, I just want to get my invite. I need, I want to get top 24 and get the invite. No, will I go to that? Oh, I don't even know where it's at, but probably not. But it would be nice just to be, uh, have it, be like, hey, I got my nine, nine nets invite. Awesome. Every time, every time I just trip and fall and eat a fat dick at the last second, I'm tired of that happening. I really am. You know? It's like I'm tired of seeing metal foes. Like, I get it. They're top tier shit. They're really good. I get it. But, like, they're, they're pretty much the new pendulum bitch. It's like, it's like, why play with fucking, um, why play with, um, with, with Performa Pal or anything like that? I mean, he threw in some fucking Dracos and it said, oh, and then of course you have the Max C. Awesome. Awesome. Well, you know what? I might as well just do plays. I'm gonna lose anyway, so I might as well just fucking do plays, right? I'm gonna lose fucking anyway. Like, wow. Wow. This guy fucking goes off like a son of a bitch. But, <laughs> but I can't go off. Like, you know what? I'm, I'm just gonna do my plays. I'm just gonna do my plays. I dead drew him to fucking two reactor dragons. He had all of his plays. He had the fucking max. He had the fucking luster. Like, fucking rip me. I've got the catapult, but I don't have my fill spell. So. Rip on that. Oh, I guess I'll just go ahead and do some Kata Curry plays. At least, uh, if, you know, if I'm if you're gonna draw some cards, and yeah, you know, at least I get to draw some cards, right? Like, fuck it, I'm gonna lose anyway, so I might as well just go ahead and just do all the plays that I can, right? So, Synchro Summon into another burrito, eat a burrito. So fuck it, I'll take the maxi challenge. Like I said, I'm gonna lose anyway, so fuck it. Uh, so, this card attack is able when this card is known as summon special summon, select a monster on the field and change its battle position. So you could just change your own battle position. 
And then I get to draw two cards. So that's pretty nice. Like that, that play is pretty strong. I have to bust out 208s and that's it. Well, I would have my play right now, but I have the monsters on the field, so. And then this would summon an Ancient Gear Monster from my hand deck graveyard, you. And this would summon an Ancient Gear Monster from my hand deck or graveyard, knowing summoning conditions to you. So, uh, it's all good. Like, I can summon both of these, and they can both attack, and then you can't activate shit. I get to pop back row. If I could bust these out right now, that'd be great. Like, if I had, like, a dark hole or something, I would hella fucking do it. Hella fucking do it, but I don't, so. <sighs> uh, there's really nothing to do right now. But lose. <laughs> like, like there's no way in Christ. But hey, I did plays, right? I did plays, so. And you can just go ahead and pend him some another centric and then fucking, you know, fuse and do hella plays. Hella plays. Like I am just outclassed. Remember when Gary Kata Curry was actually some some good shit? Like I said, this play is really good. You know. Okay. Under that max C, it's semi limited. It's less than thirty percent now. And you still, you know, draw the shit out of it, right? <laughs> So, oh, GG, 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 go ahead and kick the shit out of me. <laughs> uh, yeah, I already know, I already know, I've been seeing metaphors a lot, so I'm totally prepared for that. So the first time I went I to Utah, I believe I took Teller Knights, to, uh, Star Chef Teller Knights, and I scrubbed out real quick. The second time I had uh, Tower Turbo, and I did pretty successfully. I almost got my top 24, and then, you know, my opponent top decked a Book of Moon, and I ate a fat dick at the last second, so rip on that. And then, uh, the third time, I took Cosmos, that Cosmo get in, and, uh, I almost got my top 24, and then I lost the mirror match at the last match, and didn't get my invite, so. So, I'll just go ahead and give this man the satisfaction of beating the shit out of me, because, I mean, come on, you know, this is over. Like, just, just hurry up and end it. Just attack. Just attack. Just attack. This is, you're, you don't need to do anything else. Just attack. Just, man, man, end this duel. End it. <laughs> Shit, just attack. <laughs> you're like doing all these unnecessary plays. <laughs> yeah, you got it. You know, I didn't stand a fucking chance. Opened up with two dead cards against fucking Metal Foes again. Like, I mean, like, Metal Foes are starting to turn into the new blood. It's either Metal Foes or Blue Eyes. You're always going to face that top tier shit. I'm not in rated. I am not in rated. Like, of course I can't be in rated. I'm playing fucking, you know, OCG cards, but still, you know, everybody wants to play the Metal Foes. Everybody wants to play the Blue Eyes. It's like, why are you playing these top tier shits on here? If you're playing meta, type meta. And don't tell me that Metal Foes ain't meta, because they're, they're, oh, shit. All right? We're just going to do a bear back. <sighs> Hopefully I can open up a little bit better. I think this deck can be fairly strong if I can bust out the plate. Well, now I just drew one of him. I believe I can summon him from Hand Decker Graveyard, so he's a fine target to pitch for Twin Twister. Dude, two unexpected dies. So that, I mean, I'm sure die is so good when you have that low one normal tuner monster. Oh, okay. Critias and this you know, I mean, your name is Tamias the King, so I'm assuming that you're probably playing, like, Tamias shit. Like, you'll probably bust him out. If that's the case, then fucking that'd be bad. And you got Celestial too. So Hand Destruction's a neg, so hopefully it's freaking worth it in the end to do that play. Anything with just these cards right here is actually really good, because especially some of this, especially some of that. No, some of this, especially some of that. So, research for Diamond Dude. Shadow Miss. Uh, don't bust out Dan Claw. <laughs> like, I don't want to see Dan Claw. Oh, you send that, and then you get to go ahead and get your, uh, all right, bow. What's about to do? I'm gonna tell one other face up monster, equip it, but you don't have another one. You get to get that, and you probably play Destiny Draw. <gasps> no, Dark Ruffer. All right. And this man's just sitting there and fucking going off. I don't know what the outcome of this is gonna be. If he busts out that fucking Tamias. Oh, leg spreader. Uh oh. And then put that on top of the deck, and then. No, no, actually. Oh, Manira, of course. You know, $2,000 card. Yep, yep, yep. Mill some more. I got another pl plague and uh, absolute king. Okay. So hopefully this time I can be a little bit more successful. I don't want to say what I'm using in just case uh, someone's like, "Hey, I know what you, yeah, you know, I watched your video." But I, I think no, no, but because by the time this uh, this goes up, I should no, no, because it'll be Friday. It'll be Friday. Never mind. I was thinking that you know it already be no, it'll be Friday. Not Saturday, <laughs> so I can't say it. I, I mean, I'll, of course, I'll give you a turn report, deck profile, of all that, but yeah, I'm, I have an experiment that I want to try out. 
All right, so Absolute King will go ahead and send that. That's fine. So uh, I can literally just go ahead and, uh, of course, set this first. Yeah, set this first, because if I do this effect, I can't search anymore. So I mean, I can't set any more cards. So. And once again, I can go ahead and do the Katakuri play. So you might see this in this deck. You might see it in ABCs. Like it's just so good because you, you mean ancient silver gadget, gold gadget. They're just they're really good enablers. It's on some unexpected dies, and you got yourself some powerful plays. You know, and I'll get the I'll get the catapult. I'm thinking maybe maybe up the terraforming. I'm, I'm running two terraformings and three of the the pill spells. I'm trying to match up. I was like, I, it might be a little bit cloggy. You know, but I think I think if I have three to search for this and that's six, then I should play six and six because the play is really great. If I can, if I can get those two, those two, these two off, it's like a lifesaver. Like I'm busting out two, three thousand attack monsters that you know pop back row. And it's just the play is awesome. It's just I need both these cards and no monsters in the field. And I can I can search for one and then I can search for the other. So. Shido to go ahead and summon me. Now the question is, do I want to change his battle position? I could change his battle position and do more damage. I could just summon him defense mode and then just change your battle position. Or is it when a Katakuri monster? Let's switch her. Nope, it's Katakuri monster, so I want to I want to change her own position so I can draw the two. I thought I thought it was any monster, but nope, nope, it's Katakuri monster. So effect effect and then draw two. So good. Go to good. Ah, I did another strike, but I can't set it. <laughs> uh, and I'll just attack. Like, so you'll be seeing that play a lot, a lot. And I think I throw in the Katakuri engine because why not? Like if you're if you're already doing the. Oh, uh, I'd say like oh, there's a burning abyss or sorry, but so it has nothing to summon because there's no other burning abyss so far. So okay, this man is just milling the shit out of his deck. Uh, he has one fucking card. One fucking card. Drawing into two. He might have been able to pull something off, but I don't think so. Just Regeki. You've been milling and doing all that shit this entire duel, but you have the Regeki? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I should turn these two into like hope or something. No, I, I, I had the strike. I'll be okay. I'll be okay. Yep. Dragon Greffer going with what? Carl Dragon? Because I already know you have Maui. Stardust Charge. Cause I, I remember you pitching Melee. I know you have Melee. So you could... Uh, I'll strike that. Because I don't want you to draw. I don't want you to top deck in anything. Strike that. And that's probably game. You can summon Melee with Melee. You don't have any more cards. I think you have another Plague in the graveyard, but you don't have any cards in your hand to do Plague, so... Oh, I forgot about Celestial. Completely forgot about that card. Completely forgot about that card. I was like, I was like he has no more resources. It's over. Like, nah, nah, Celestial. Draw two. And then he quits. Alright, we'll get another duel and bear back. So, uh, wish me luck, people. Wish me luck, because you already know my luck is terrible. So, you know, do I have do I have the skill? Yeah, I got you know I got the skill. I got the skills to pay the bills. Uh, do I have the deck? I, I, personally, I think so. I think that I'm gonna be taking a, a fairly powerful deck. Uh, I'm gonna set this because I I'm fine with. I, 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 lately, I've been saying that I don't like setting Tone Twister, correct? But I think I'm okay if it's just one, you know? If it's just that one card, because I don't think that they're going to take a neg to Twin Twister, my Twin Twister. If they want to take a neg to Twin Twister, my one Twin Twister, more power to you. But, you know, I think they're going to leave it alone. They might just go ahead and set some cards and then I'll Twin Twister and then I don't like saying Twin Twister and then something else, you know? That that gets to be a problem. Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't, 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 don't infinity me. <laughs> don't. <laughs> oh, Galaxy Eyes. So... Summon Galaxy Knight, Galaxy Knight, I summon you back your Galaxy Dragon. Hold on, Galaxy Dragon, go on to an XC play, rank 8 play. Powerful, powerful rank 8 play, fucking make that broken ass card from Fake Card Friday this week. <laughs> if you haven't seen that already, like, if, if you haven't seen that card already, if he had, if that card was real, I'd be dead right now. I'd be dead. Like, <laughs> okay, well, I wasn't planning on activating anything anyway, so that's fine. <laughs> You can have that, that ain't what I'm mad at. You can set some background. Oh, of course you gotta make your your dark matter. Yep, yep, yep. Dark matter, so stupid. Oh, and it's the Felgram shit too. All right, awesome. Uh, I really don't wanna send anything. If anything, the fucking gadgets can go. Like, I'm not really sure how I feel about ancient 
gear gadget thing place. Everybody else is pretty important for right now. Yep, so. In the standby phase, that will go off. Like, such an enabler. It's just like, yeah, just go ahead and summon a shit ton of dragons. Why not? Yep, vanish from my start from my graveyard. Gone. Well, I, well, that was my fucking, uh, that was my Norden play. Now I don't even have a Norden play. I don't have shit. Like, wow. Lucky, thank you, Dark Matter. I could have handled you, but nah, fucking, fucking Divine Dragon with the fucking Dark Matter Felgrin. I'm fucking ripped. Like, I can summon this and do what? Like, I guess I could still mumble summon and go into Norden, but. What the fuck? <laughs> so it's like, it's like, that's how I feel about it right now. Like, just, what the fuck? Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I can go into like Utopia the Lightning and then attack over like his Dark Matter or something. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Shit. <laughs> like, man, why do you have to. Why do I have a drawing of this? I was thinking about banishing these. I was thinking about it because I already had a catapult. At this point, there's really nothing else to search. Like, god damn it. God damn it. Oblivion or enabling ass Norden. Times like these, I wish I had Exiton. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, to my opponent, seven. Yep, I could Exiton his ass right now. But instead, I will not be able to do that, so. Uh, I'm thinking about just Castellan. I was thinking about Utopia and Utopia Lightning, but I want to get rid of him and kill him. Because I don't want him to be on the field. <coughs> like, wow. Dark Matter, you you are a SOB, Dark Matter. Like, yeah, yeah, send three fucking dragons from your deck to your grave. Like, are you on crack on me? Like, the card came out and I'm driving over I had to immediately be banned, so. So, pretty much, if I don't draw into, like, a terraforming or something, then I'm pretty much not doing anything. <laughs> like, he's not looking good for old Daniel here. Oh, and I didn't even remember this effect. This card destroying the opponent's monster by battle. You could target a level 7. I didn't even know about this effect. Wow. So, all the monsters were just really great. Yeah, yeah, see? So, if I left the Gal Galaxy Soldier, I would have got Infinity. So, I mean, either way, I'm fucked. Either way, I'm fucked. <laughs> At least kiss me first. Like, I... I don't know. Maybe... I'm not getting Gear Town. Like, maybe I should just... Maybe I should go triple terraforming at this point. At this fucking point. Never mind. I'm gonna get Infinity anyway. I'm gonna get Infinity anyway. <laughs> You wouldn't go neg on that play unless you had Infinity. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Alright. Fucking Galaxy Soldier. I swear to Christ. Alright, we'll get another duel. Be right back. Ah, I didn't need the luck. I got I got lucky in one thing that uh, I ordered my card and uh, I was I ordered the priority shipping so three to four days and they just happened to come in on Thursday right when we were leaving. So this record ahead of time. This is right before I leave on trip. I said by the time you see this video, I should already be in Utah. Uh, I'll go ahead and go second. Ah, see? See? I hope to terraform me three. There it is. So I can just go terraform me, play my gear town, pop my gear town. Oh no, it's Cosmos. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Wow. And he opened up the Dank Daddy too? Hey, open up the Dank Daddy! <laughs> Bruh. Oh, it, it, oh, it's fucking, uh, it's fucking Cosmo Demise. Yep. Go ahead and grab that tin can. Let's go. Fucking summon tin can. Set your back row. Carter Demise. Like, wow. <laughs> Like, next time you want to play meta, just say meta. Wow, and you didn't get card demise? That's shocking. I kind of thought you'd, uh, you'd get your card demises. <laughs> so, you know my luck, you'll probably get fucking <laughs> Dark Daddy. Nope, nope, you didn't get it. But I'm, I'm assuming that you probably have a set called The Haunted or something like that. Like, I, I, I know, I know. I know this deck, I know. <laughs> You're going to be in complete control. So what I give you, Slip Rider? No, Slip Rider stuff. What did I give you? Dark Eclipser. Okay. Okay, I gave you Dark Eclipser, so that's kind of rip. I can go ahead and do this powerful play and summon two Gear Town monsters. Like, that's just so strong. It's like, bam, and that goes off, and it's just like, hey, I'm gonna summon another fucking Ancient Gear. And if I attack, then you can't do shit, right? Yeah, if I go into the battle phase right now, so, I'm gonna go into battle phase. I'm gonna make you fucking play your shit. If not, you're gonna get fucking wrecked. I'm gonna pop, the, pop these two. I'm gonna go into battle phase. Oh my god, wow. You're about to get destroyed. 
<laughs> You're about to get destroyed? <laughs> yes. Pop this. You can't play it. Wow, there goes your drowning. <laughs> oh, yeah, he, he is playing fucking Cosmo Demise. He is playing it. Pop that one. <laughs> there goes your Cosmo Demise. Damn, get wrecked. <laughs> oh, my God. Damn, Ancient Gear. <laughs> See, that play is so strong. <laughs> you can't actually make shit and I get the party record and you can't play it because then damage stuff and you still can't play shit. Like, wow. Wow, as long as I don't draw these two and I get this play, that's pretty powerful. Wow, he got destroyed, he got demolished. I bet he, I bet he wanted to tag out into that dark eclipse, but uh, uh, he should have been holding the A button, my nig. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and get into the duel there. Yeah, but all my card came in, like, yo boy, yo mastery, yo nigga Daniel, he has a play set of Song Strikes, and that's just fantastic. <laughs> that's just fantastic. <laughs> wow, well, this opening hand's not the greatest. <laughs> I could summon this and summon that. Opening up with Trumpeteer is not the greatest of cards to draw. I should put in a, another fucking, uh, like I put all these rank 8 plays because I like to do the rank 8 play because I have the card create plays. See, my dragon's 9, but I should put some other fucking sync 8s in here. Like, all I can do is this. Like, that's dumb. I'm gonna take it slow. There's really no reason. Or, I guess I could summon this, summon this. This will summon my Katakuri, turn into defense mode, I draw cards. I guess that's not terrible. Oh no, this is going to look machines, right? Yeah, you're not a machine, you're a plant, so... I don't want to feel my deck, though. If I got to if I got to get the draw off of the Kata Curry play, then I probably would have done it, but... I should put, like, an Omega in here. <laughs> I can make him so easily. Like, <laughs> just summon, summon, make Omega, pick something out of your hand, just because, just because, hop out of the way with shit. Oh, Grotic Beast. All right. Yep, I'll take that. I said, and look at the. Oh, wait, no, I don't. Ah, uh, you know what? Should have went into fucking uh, Gear Giant. I thought I had. I thought I had. I thought this was the other card. No, that's my. Uh, that's another Gear Town. So. Alright, well. Yeah, I guess I'll just go ahead and do the fucking Gear Giant X plays. If my opponent will let me. Like, I'm now a turn behind because I'm a fucking idiot. So. I'll hold on to this. This might be useful later. So. Yep, we're just gonna go into Gear Giant. Detach and get you, because you can give me that for that. So I, yeah, I'm just gonna be, I'm gonna be a couple turns behind. If I known that I wasn't paying attention, these cards look similar. Like the fucking the the catapult and gear town. Like no offense to the catapult and gear town, they look similar. They really do. Dexen. Dexen. I revealed my deck now, so it really doesn't matter. I was holding off, but I fucked up. I should have revealed my deck. I, I, that was a misplay. See, because then I can summon this and then get the surge, but then I have a monster on my field. So it's going to take me at least two more turns to actually bust out this play. So rip on that. Yep, I knew it. I was like, he probably has one of his revival cards, Roger of One or whatever. How strong is his Roger monster? Is it strong? Is it 21, 24? His plane coat? I don't remember how strong plane coat is. Maybe he'll go into it, maybe not. Utopia, Utopia Lightning, Dark Rebellion. Alright. Oh! I might be fucked. No, 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 because I have I have Silver Badge, so I can go Silver Badge to summon and to get Wyvern and do something about the Dark Rebellion, so. I'm okay. I was thinking that I might be fucked, that I might take too much damage before I can pull off my plays. Because I think it's going to be a lot of back and forth. A lot of back and forth in this duel. Wow, and then I draw into another fucking Wyvern. So I got no cards to set, so I don't have to worry about that, so. Let's go ahead and summon you. Like that, that court moment when you summon Trumpeteer. I mean, Trumpeteer's not a terrible draw. He's a 1900 beater as a tuner monster, so it's not terrible. It's just. <laughs> uh, this is all my fault. Now, if he stops my play right now, right now, like, if he has, like, this stops my play, then grab. Because he could just summon a monster and kill me, you know? This is 36, so all he needs to do is really summon a monster with, like, what, 1200 attack? And I know he's got that in spades, like, unless he summons, like, another unicorn or something. No, because even if he does stop me, then I can, I, then I still have my place, because then I won't have any monsters on my field. Wow, he scooped? Nigga! Alright, I guess maybe his hand was just straight up at, and he knew I had the setup, and he was just like, fuck it, I scoop. Alright, we'll get another duel, grab back. Alright. So, uh, I got all the cards, I'm buying a lot of the cards from, uh, I'm not sure if there's still Team Ninja, they might have changed their name to, like, Team XD or something like that, XD? I don't know, I don't know. From what it seems like, it seems like they changed their name, I don't know. But, uh, buying a lot of cards from them. Alright, so, especially something tricky. 
Oh, okay. Summon Red Resonator. Red Resonator summon. So you about to bust out like an Ultima or something? No, no, you're you're gonna bust out fucking Crystal Math, possibly. Oh no, no, maybe no. I think maybe Abyss. Abyss. Abyss would be. Ooh. <laughs> like I might have to actually fucking bait him. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, he can do this. He could've won the Crystal Mess. Shit. Unless he's locked out and he can only go into these cards. Yeah, we go ahead and grab that back. This is a very strong monster. Very strong indeed. Wow, he ain't done. He ain't done. He ain't done. You know, fucking one for one pitch and then go into your fucking shit and then... Well, you don't have anything to tribute, though. Yeah, you don't have anything to tribute unless you want to tribute him. So, you, wait, wait, wait. Instead of going with the fucking guy who negates, you're going to bust out the guy who fucking tributes but doesn't do shit? Like, you want this, not him. Like, okay. Okay, so. When I when I F your skis with a fucking, like, Dark Rebellion or something. Like, what does this card do? Tribute. Remember our chain from your grand value card inflicts damage. You're probably going to quit. Like, I, I actually... you probably end up quitting. Like, wow. I... Like, I'm gonna get rid of your fucking abyss, and you're just gonna fucking hit that surrender button. Or, my opponent has left the duel, so. I'm another catapult. Can't set anything, but I don't, I don't have anything to set. Like, the only thing that's in here that can set is the Solemn Brigade, so. Oh, I thought I ran, like, Dark Rebellion or something. Nope, so, I guess I'll just go into Castell. Toby Lightning might be useful if he doesn't negate me with that, so. Yeah. I mean, I don't think this duel's gonna last too much longer. Cause he he got he got booty rapes like look at that you used your entire hand entire hand you should just left that abyss like I don't even know why you went into uh, Bane what's his name Bane yeah Bane all right let's go quit but there's there's no fucking way <laughs> wow all right now I'm getting a whole bunch of my ancient wyverns like, I guess at least gold got it's fairly strong so I can get some more damage in. Might as well search. Uh, I can search for. I don't need you. I guess I'll search for my gadget. That's not terrible to search for. Cast off should be plenty. Alright, okay, it's the one that can't be destroyed. Once we turn this card, destroy battle is not. So I'll just attack you twice. Wow. So wish me luck. Wish me luck. Uh, I just want to get the invite. That's the way I am, and I think I think the deck. I think my side deck is fucking shanks. I expect a lot, a lot of PK because last time I went there, there was a ton of PK. I mean, what? I faced round one of scrub, round two monarchs, round two PK, round four PK, round five PK, round six PK, round seven PK, and then round eight was the mirror match. So I'm expecting, especially since they get hit too hard, and it seems like Utah loves them some fucking PK. I'm probably going to be facing a lot of PK. So. With that, I'm just gonna leave it like that. Like, why, why exceed these two and anything? I'm just, I'm okay. You know, he could top deck Regeki and I wouldn't give a shit. Like, yeah. Once you went in that Bane and that Bane got fucked with no back or nothing back it up, like, like, you went neg on the one for one, you had Abyss. I was like, oh shit, man, it's Abyss. It's that nigga Abyss. Like, I'm about to, I'm about to fucking bait him. I was thinking about just summoning this and summoning this and maybe if he doesn't stop that, going to be a lightning to handle him. But if he didn't, then I could just fucking do my cutoff. Like, I wouldn't be strong enough. Isn't Bane like, isn't Abyss like 32 or something like that? Like, Cool. Yeah, that'd be that'd be a fucking struggle. I probably wouldn't even summon like I'd probably just summon some ancient gears with this play. Like it it, it wouldn't even be like uh, my big dragon level when I'm dragon. It'd be like level four. So I, after I bait, I can like make a you know castell and spin him after he negates the first time. So, but nope, nope, nope. He fucked himself. So lots of PK. So I'm ready for that. Lots of blue eyes. I'm ready for that. I'm be borrowing a lot, a lot of cards from the team. Uh, it's gonna be fun. Like even if I don't top, even if I don't, you know, get my invite, it'll still be a lot of fun. I, I enjoy these trips. I, you know, they pop up every once in a couple months, and it's fun to get out of the house and you know see friends that I don't see that often. So anyway, I am done. So you know, like I said, just record ahead of time. By the time you see this video and comment, I'm already in Utah. So wish me luck. You know, uh, share your luck with me, everybody. I'm fucking raising my hands like fucking Goku. I'm about to do a fucking luck spirit bomb on the fucking Utah regionals and get my invites. All right, I'll, I'll, I'm not disappoint you. And you guys are gonna see that deck profile. And you're gonna be like, interesting, interesting. If if I, you know, I mean, if I top and you know do well, maybe I can like send the deck profile to like maybe like Vexicus or like Imco40, and then they can upload it to their channels, and then I can you know get some views and subs off of that maybe. 
I don't know. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Thanks for support. And I will see you guys next week with some more daily duels. Thanks for watching.